Hey there, I'm Amy Lettingham, and I'm here to help you take charge of your love life. So today we have an important topic. Let's get started. You know those times where you're saying, I'm not good enough, I'm not smart enough, I'm not pretty enough, I'm too old. Ah, oh, you've heard this before, right? Yeah, I said it to myself, you said it to yourself. Maybe we don't say it out loud. Maybe we do it through our actions. Maybe we settled for BTN relationships, which is better than nothing, right? Definitely done that in the past, where we just say, oh my gosh, there's no good men out there, or they're all gay. Or we just say, oh my gosh, I'm giving up on love. I'm not dating anymore. There is nobody out there for me. Yes, you're essentially giving up everything by saying that because you actually believe it to be true. Why do we treat ourselves so poorly by saying these things to ourselves? If I asked you right now, would you say that to someone you loved dearly? Absolutely not, but you'll say it to yourself. And you're wondering, why do I do this? Why am I inflicting pain on me? Well, I will share a little secret with you. The reason why we say these horrible things through our actions, not just our words, Sometime, sometime long ago, maybe we had a parent that was very critical or a friend or an ex that told us we're not good enough or we're not pretty enough or we're too old. And we take their opinion, their one person's opinion, and we make it a standard and a basis of who we are for the rest of our lives. We take on their judgments, we take on their opinions, we throw it on our back. And we climb through life with those judgments. And you know what? They're not true. They are absolutely not true. Who allows them to set the standard for you? The standard should be set by ourselves. We should look in the mirror and we should have self-compassion and speak to ourselves like a, like a loving parent, somebody that really cares about us and say, you know what, honey, you are good enough. You're smart enough, you're beautiful and you are perfect where you are. You don't have to compare yourself to anyone else and stop that. Because every time you compare yourself to other people, you get stuck. We are all different. We all have different paths. Yes, it's exciting to see people become popular. It's exciting to see people being loved, but you are loved too. Be your own champion. And if you're not where they're at, it's okay. Everything's a skill. You can learn the skill, but you don't have to rush and put pressure on yourself and make yourself feel less than because you're not there. If you think this is an important message for your friends to hear, for someone you know, if you have a girlfriend out there that's just struggling and you need to pass this on, please do. I would love for you to spread this message so that they can start feeling good about themselves and open themselves to the love they deserve. I have so much more to say here, but I don't have enough time. Please do visit my website at amythedatingcoach.com and subscribe to my newsletter where I send out weekly information, videos like this, so that you can take charge of your love life. Thank you so much. Subscribe to the YouTube channel and I will see you in the next video.